Hey guys, Christina here, and we are moving out of our house today. And I didn't get a chance to film right after we like sold it, or I guess we accepted the offer. So I'm gonna go ahead and film it now. I have some of the pictures from the listing still, and it's always just fun to look at how things have changed. So I'm gonna go through and show you how everything changed. And we've been here three and a half years. So let's start with the front yard. All right, I've got kids walking around. So we took the tree out that was here. It was just causing a lot of problems. And so we took that out. We dug the garden up and put, well, dug the grass up and put garden there. We also painted around the trim there, painted around the door, and we took off the really weird screen that was on there, painted the stairs. It also has a new roof new siding, not new siding, new gutters, new siding junction boxes. These are all flowers we planted here. And then back over here, we built this box over here. And we planted rhubarb, which is just dying off now for the year. Chives, raspberries, there's some leftover flowers. The garage didn't change, but I'll show you it anyways. So it's a double garage that's extra high. We've got shelving all around. That's all empty right now. So here we painted trim, painted the walls. There's new blinds that are white. We've got one box of food waiting for the neighbor to come pick it up. We painted that white. We got a new, what's this called? Thermostat. We changed that and put a new one in. We painted the doors. Are all white in here? Here's the living room. So again, paint and trim. New blinds. I think that's all we did in here. Some of the furniture the buyers are keeping, and that's why it's still here like these. Here's a look this way. In the mudroom, I have a whole video on this I can link up top, but we put new flooring down painted the trim and the walls. We built this big rack system here um, because we actually, there was a closet here and we took that completely out and put these in and we had a bench with it. We painted the door, the trim, the walls. <laughs> the basement's the same, but I'll take you down anyways. A big unfinished basement down here. So we did put a larger um, window well just because we weren't sure if we were gonna stay here, if we were gonna develop this into a bedroom, and we wanted it more accessible as an emergency exit when we were redoing our patio. And then the only thing we did down here was we did add a sub pump. Everything else is exactly the same. Just one big unfinished basement. I'll take you back upstairs now. So the hallway, same thing. Trim, paint. <laughs> In the bathroom here, we did the flooring, the paint and the trim there for the kids to go to the bathroom before we leave. Over here is pretty different. We painted the walls and the trim and my husband built these shelves 
our storage unit for us. It's got a countertop on it, like a kitchen countertop. And we've got two huge cupboards that we use for homeschooling and crafts because we need to homeschool the table here. Everything echoes. Trim, paint. <laughs> we did add a screen door that wasn't there before. In the kitchen, again, paint the door, walls, trim. This is a new dishwasher because it broke on us. New blinds for both here and in the dining room there. Everything else is the same. peek outside. We built the garden boxes. We took the deck down because it actually was not in very good shape. We put a stone patio. I'll take you upstairs now. So again, painting, trim, all the way up. So at the top of the stairs here, we had our bookcases, but they're gone now. And right over here, again, we painted all the doors, trim, walls, everything's painted. The boys' room, nothing else really changed except for painting those doors. This bathroom, we did put the floor in as well. And paint and trim. <laughs> we also spray painted the fixtures in here to make them black. Only thing in here is we painted the trim. Closet's the same. Now this closet over here isn't a closet anymore. <laughs> so we took the closet out and we built this desk that's got space for like two workstations and then a bunch of shelving. Again, painted the doors, the walls, the trim. It's like a broken record. <laughs> this is the younger two's room. Got the skylight here. Lots of natural light. And door, trim, paint, everything the same again. We changed out the light fixture in here. The buyers are taking this furniture, that's why it's staying here. We changed out the blinds. Just updated everything from the brown. Everything was brown. The closet's the same though. We took some of the stuff out that's downstairs. In the bathroom, again, we spray painted the fixtures, did new flooring, paint, trim, painted as well. And this is the bedroom. see our yard from out here. The play structure's gone. But little yard. Before I go outside, I forgot to mention this too. We put a solar tunnel in, which is kind of like a skylight, but it kind of reflects the light more. So it looks like a light is on, but that's just the sunlight outside. So it's a really nice way to bring light into a room without having to actually put a light in. So like I said, the deck that was there was um, 
it had issues and there was some of it was rotted and we also needed to regrade and so we my husband did new stairs we put a screen door on new stone patio that was bigger the window well we added a barbecue place there and then we made these garden boxes and that's the changes to the yard from over here that's it those are the changes we made in three and a half years it's um sad to leave this house there's some great things about it but we're really excited for the future and i will have more videos coming out i'm going to try and film some of our trips so if you have any questions you can leave them in the comment section down below otherwise i hope this finds you having a great day take care